Hey everyone, welcome back to another quick Photoshop tutorial. In this one, we're just going to be taking a look at where the liquify tool is and how to use it. So on this painting I've done here, I've got the eyes a little bit off, so I want to correct that. Unfortunately, the downside to using the liquify tool is that there isn't an effective way to apply it to multiple layers. So that means I'm going to select all of my layers. I'm going to right click and I'm going to merge layers. So everything is now on one. From there, we're going to come to this top panel press filter and then you're going to come down and find the liquify option click on that and that should bring up this page here now you've got quite a lot of options here the standard one we're going to look at is this top left one it should be selected by default forward warp and what that allows you to do is just click and drag do have a play around with some of these tools for example the bloat one is quite good at enlarging things but if people are interested we'll do another tutorial on those in the future so all I'm going to do is quite literally with this brush selected, you can change the size of your brush over here. I'm going to click the eye that I want to change and in this case I'm going to drag it down a little bit. So I'm relatively happy with that. You can go in, make your brush smaller, play around with it a lot. I find the more you play around with something with a liquify tool, usually the worse it gets. So you want to keep this quite simple. Once you're happy press OK. And it really is as simple as that. So if I just take a look at my history so that you can see it before and after. That was it before. And you can see that I've lowered it there. I've only done it as a quick example here. I might not have got it perfect. But hopefully you guys found this video useful. If you did, leave me a comment below. Let me know what videos you guys want to see next. I'll put a link in the description box to all my other Photoshop Basics tutorials like this. Smash that thumbs up button. And of course, make sure that you subscribe and turn notifications on for future content. Thanks for watching everyone.